Hello everybody, I want to show you with this video 5 tips and tricks for the health here at the Xiaomi 12. By the way, this works also for the Xiaomi 12 Pro and Xiaomi 12 X. Okay, the first mode I want to show you is the anti-flicker mode. Uh, the flickering uh, could, uh, makes your eyes very tired and uh, gives you stress as well. So let me show you how you can prevent this stress. For that, just scroll down right next to the camera. Then you will have here the control center. And the part of the control center is here the symbol for the settings. Just tap on it. Then you need to go to the point display. And if you scroll down a bit, you will have here the anti flicker mode. And it has to be marked blue here, like in my case. Uh, so uh, just enable it. And um, a negative effect is that uh, the refreshing rate of the phone is now at 60 Hz. So you cannot have the 120 Hz here uh, of the phone. But 60 Hz is completely uh, enough because also the previous smartphone has 60 Hz. And uh, if you don't play uh, intensive, powerful games, uh, then it is absolutely okay. So just enable here the anti flicker mode to protect your eyes. And there are some more options for the eyes to reduce the stress and so on. And uh, one of them is the blue light filter. So let's go back here and let's scroll down here right next to the camera again. Then we will have the control center and we will have here some shortcuts. If you scroll down again in the shortcuts, you have some more options, by the way. And one of it is here the reading mode. So the icon with the eye. So just tap on it and you will see that the screen have changed a bit the color and so on because um, we have enabled now the blue light filter. And what I recommend to you now is to long press this eye icon because then we are now here at some more settings. And um, so just uh, leave this classic mode turn on and go on the arrow here because then you can set up the color temperature. And as more warm it is, as better it is, as better it will reduce the eye strain. Yeah. But if you say, okay, I don't want to have the blue light filter really, uh, I'm not really used to and so on, because at the beginning is, it is a bit unusual, uh, then I would really recommend to you to have it at latest in the evening hours, because it affects also a lot your sleep. I can have my problems fell into sleep and so on. No? Okay, if you want to have it, not on a day, have it at latest in the evening, hours uh, and you can turn it on automatically. For that, just go back here, then go here on chat shoot. And here should enable the good night's read because then the blue light filter turn on automatically if the sun sets and if the sun rises, the blue light filter will turn off. But if you have the chance, leave it on all over the day. And there's another feature which one uh, protects you also in the evening hours. Um, it is a dark mode. Let me go again here to the control center, scroll down right next to the camera, scroll down in the shortcuts again, and then you have next to the reading mode, the dark mode. The dark mode will turn uh, on uh, many white stuff into a darker stuff. Huh? So that means uh, if you have a very white screen in the night, a uh, very white, white screen, and it uh, disturbs your eyes as well if everything is dark around you. So you should have the dark mode in the evening hours. On the day it's a bit uh, difficult because if you have a lot of sunlight, sunlight um, then um, uh, you can't read really well and that gives your eyes also stress. So just enable the dark mode just in the evening hours. To do that, long press the dark mode. So the symbol for the dark mode, then you're in the settings of the dark mode. Go then here on schedule dark mode and do it like in my case here now, it turned off again. Uh, just go here on schedule dark mode and um, turn it on from sunset to sunrise. It will really help your eyes and turn it on automatically in the evening hours and turn it off in the morning. And there's some more options for the health. Um, also, you can check your heart rate here with the phone. Let me show you what I mean. For that, just scroll down right next to the camera, go down here to the symbol for the settings. And then you need to scroll down to the point special features. And here we have the point heart rate. So now you have to lay down your finger here on that uh, fingerprint sensor. But don't worry, it doesn't match your fingerprint here. And hold your finger here on this sensor, like 
so is in my case. Ne? And don't move it, very important. It takes 15 se seconds and then it will give you an average of your heart rate. I don't know if it's okay. <laughs> uh, if you're a doctor, leave me, leave it uh, in the comments maybe if I'm fine or not. Um, I hope it isn't too late then. And uh, yeah, that is my heart rate. Check yours and from time to time it's good to know it and uh, in cases you have a problem or something like this with it. And uh, there's another tool to protect your heart as well, in my point of view. Because we all know that the smartphone is giving us stress. We receive many uh, messages, we receive many calls sometimes also if we have less time and it gives us stress. We are looking all over the day on the phone to check if you have notifications or not and so on. But it's a way to um, give you a little time out you know, for a moment. Let me show you what I mean. So just scroll on right next to the camera, scroll on again here, yeah, the shortcuts as we have learned, and this DND mode here. Do not disturb. Um, long press here, the symbol, which one looks like a moon. Scroll down a bit, and then we will have here the point do not disturb area. If we turn on here, um, the calls and the messages are muted automatically. Um, and you can select also if you want to have a notify about your calls. No? And what I recommend to you if uh, maybe there's an urgent call which one calls you a lot, no? uh, then you can hear uh, notified by repeating calls. No? So I think this is a good point. And if you say, okay, uh, I want to have my phone enabled uh, all over the day, but just at a certain time, maybe in the evening hours to the morning, no? then you can set it here as chat show that it always turn on automatically and turn off um, automatically. Yeah? You can set a start time and an ending time and you could say if it's every day or if you want to have a Saturday and if you want to have it on a weekend permanently stay tuned. Yeah, I think uh, you have now a bit of overview what you can do here for your health with the phone. It's not that uh, less and uh, I really recommend this to you. We just have one life and so on. Think about and um, yeah. I hope I could help you with this video and uh, answer your questions and show you something new maybe. And uh, yeah, maybe if you want, you can leave me a nice comment or give me a thumbs up. That would be very helpful for my videos. Uh, thank you so, so much for. And you have created also some other more for uh, yeah, some other videos with some more tips and tricks and so on. Or you can also subscribe me to don't miss a new video. Thank you so, so much for all your support. And uh, yeah, maybe until next time. Ciao.